What's up everyone and welcome to American Truck Simulator Logging Edition. Today we're taking off from the beautiful Flagstaff, Arizona. Look at that sky. Beautiful sky. It's 7 a.m. and we're heading to Camp Bird um, with a load uh, 24,499 pounds. It says beverages but it's clearly logs. Broken mod. Um, we got two hours and 49 world of truck minutes to make this run and we stand to make $5,495 from this run. Um, we've got 80 miles, two hours and six minutes, so it's not going to be a problem. Let's, uh, let's get underway and get these logs delivered to Camp Bird. Is it, I don't know how to, you know, I've never been to Arizona. Is it Camp Bird? Verde? 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 Ver, I don't know how to pronounce it. You'll have to let me know in the description down below if you know how to properly pronounce Camp Bird, Arizona. Um, <laughs> anyway, like I said... I don't know what I'm doing. Um, I live in California. I've been to many, many states in this wonderful, badass country, but I've never actually been to Arizona. So, yeah. This mirror FOV mod is actually, it's hard to see out of those small mirrors. So I'm trying a different setting on the Yeti today. So, I mean, let me know. I'll, I'll probably find out any, oh my God, frame rapage. Wow. <laughs> I'll probably find out any, oh, shift, dummy. I'll probably find out anyway because it's like a millionth time trying this line. Um, if it sounds better when I do editing, but uh, let me know what you guys think sounds better in the description down below. stuck here waiting at the light. Oh, that light's going to turn quick for us. Wow, the frames are real in this episode. <laughs> Hopefully they get better once we hit the uh, the open road. I really hope they do, because this is terrible right now. There's a truck right behind me like that. Wow. All right, here we go. So yeah, like I said, I'm trying a different pattern on the Yeti. I'm, I'm hoping it's going to work out good. I just, I don't know. It's hard to say. It's, it'll be clear as day when I go to edit this if it sounds better than yesterday's video. But uh, I'm hoping so much. It's hard to, um, you know, I stay busy. I've got a full-time job, a family, a house, a property, and, you know, I'm I mean, don't, don't get me wrong, I'm not complaining. I'm sitting here living the American dream and get to play video games 
all the time when I'm not working. But uh, but point being, I lead a very busy life, and it's it's very hard to do some significant recording and then stop and listen to it and then record more and then stop and listen to it and then record more and it's just difficult to to find the time to do that kind of stuff so oftentimes a lot of the settings I change are after recording videos for you guys I, I see something and it needs to be changed so I make a little adjustment and change it for the next video frames have improved at least. I'm not used to these roads out here though. I'm so used to cruising through California. How much farther do we have to go on this run? Oh, 46 miles. Won't be long now. That's a guy I cut off earlier. Sorry, buddy. It's my bad. Here's my trick. Oh. Holding that clutch in life. Oh shit. <laughs> worried me for a second there I had too much speed like there's any such thing am I right I did get a weird graphical error while I was driving the uh, truck to pick up this trailer um, kinda made me worry guys that my video cards going out uh, I use an older video card. I use a GTX 760 and it's severely overclocked. Um, I mean, it's overclocked right to the border of being usable um, and melting down. I think I have my uh, CPU clock set at like 120 over and my memory clock's at 600 over. Um, so yeah, it, it's, I mean, it's right on that borderline of being, uh, just a hot mess. So, uh, it wouldn't surprise me at all if it was going out. Um, I'd really like to replace it, but there's so much that's happened to the PC world since I built it. I built this computer nearly a year ago, for those of you that don't know. And there's so much that's gone on, I, I kind of don't know where to go first, uh, I mean, you've got the 1080s out. I'd love to get one, but I just don't think that's going to happen. You've got the, uh, you know, when, I mean, when I built this computer, eight core processors generally just for the average, oh, Jesus. Can't find the right gear in here. Um, an eight core processor was just kind of out of reach for, for the average gamer. Um, Unless you had plenty of money or your mom and dad was buying it for you or something. Well, you know, I am a mom or dad, so so it's uh, kind of out of reach. But I actually, I just built my son last weekend. I built him a gaming computer. Gosh, get the gear right. And uh, his computer actually has an 8-core, 4 gigahertz. Um, it's an AMD FX80. 690 I think 80 something um, amazing amazing machine it turned out being and he's using the same I had a uh, I gave him, I put a hand me down I had a, a spare GTX 760 that I threw in it for him and uh, that computer is just a screamer it's absolutely amazing so I, I'm not sure I, I looked at a 90 
what was it, a, an FX9810 or some 90 something. It was an 8 core, 4.7 gigahertz, but it required liquid cooling. And I've never done it. I mean, I know liquid coolers. I found one, a, a decent one, for like 50 bucks. So I know they've come a long way. But, um, I just didn't. I don't know. I've never messed with liquid cooling before, so I I don't know. I was kind of apprehensive to use it. Oh, are we going to have another one of these? Um, I was kind of apprehensive to use it. Don't honk at me, biatch. I was apprehensive to, to try something like that because I just don't have the money right now to rebuild my computer if something goes wrong. Not, not to say that it will, but, I mean, you know what I mean. But, uh, yeah, I don't know. Anyway, back to the meat of this story. I don't know whether I should upgrade the, the graphics card or the CPU. I, I just don't know. Pretty much anything I do to this computer would be an upgrade at this point. So I'm not sure where to start. I do use, uh, I believe it's all Corsair. There's four sticks in there. There's, uh got two eights and a couple twos. I've got a total of 20 gigabytes of memory, so I'm doing good in that department. But um, anyway, guys, we, as you can see, have finished this run. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, subscribe if you haven't already. Let me know about the audio, how you think it's working out, what you think would make it better. Um, and yeah, we'll catch you guys next time. Thanks again, everyone.